Hello, everybody. All right, how's everybody doing today? So let's just go right into it. So here are five tips that you to use to program your subconscious mind for success. So anything you desire, you can use it and you can get it by using the power of your mind. Our minds, are our thoughts, affect our reality. So let's just jump right into it. A little bit about the subconscious mind. So the subconscious mind is the part of your mind that controls your actions, your habits. Actions and habits are what really runs the show. We are 97% unconscious thoughts. Your subconscious mind controls your dreams, it controls your heart rate, metabolic state. But the most important thing about the subconscious mind is this. It is very infinite. It can literally pull information from the field. The universe is made up of a field, quantum field, foam. that gives all potential, all realities, parallel realities. Everything that you can imagine and unimagine is out there. Your subconscious mind can go interact with that field and pull it in and then send it to your conscious mind. So conscious mind directs the subconscious mind. All right, so here are the five things, tips that you can use right now to program your sub subconscious for success. Tip number one is to make your desires normal or find people that think and agree that your, the big goals you want are normal to you. That will reinforce this in the subconscious that this is an acceptable and believable thing. Okay, that's tip number one. Tip number two, you have to be a little delusional with your mind. What does that mean? You have to convince your mind that it's possible by thinking big, by thinking outside the box. When you start to see those big goals and those big dreams and be a little delusional, it will convince your subconscious mind that your reality is possible. Well, why is that? Why do I have to be a little delusional? Why can't I be regular? Because your subconscious mind is illogical. It's not like your regular thinking mind. Your regular thinking mind will see things as logical stuff. That's gonna put limits on you. Why does it put limits on me? Because your regular mind is limited. It can only see from the past and it tries to predict what's called the future. So when you start to make your dreams a little delusion, in other words, see yourself having that big thing that no one else would see. Your subconscious believes that. Why is that? Because the subconscious, what? It creates from an infinite field. You gotta remember one important point before I go to tip number three is this. Reality is malleable. We make it up. That means anything is literally possible. There are infinite possibilities right now of whatever you want. There are things out there that you can't even imagine that's waiting for you right now, but you cannot get it because you use your conscious mind to observe reality. Our conscious mind just isn't evolved enough to see the infinite potentiality. All right, tip number three to make your subconscious mind program for success is to speak things in the present moment. In other words, don't look at your desires or your goals as a destination in the future. Like, oh, one day I will get this. One day I will be successful. Very soon I'm gonna be rich. Very soon I'm gonna win the lottery. Very soon I'm gonna buy the house. One day it'll happen for me. That one day will never happen. The reason why, because your subconscious cannot understand the concept of linear time. It only exists in the moment. When you put things in the present moment and you speak in the present moment by saying stuff like, you know, I already have this. This is possible. It's happening now. I am receiving this. Or even better, when you use question formats, is how would it make me feel to have what I desire? What would my life look like now with X and X amount of money in my bank account? That's when the subconscious mind now takes the information and it starts to process the information for you. It's a process. And the thing about your subconscious, it's a answer, question answering generator. It has to prove to you what you put. So you gotta be in the present moment. So remember that, okay, tip number one, make it normal. Tip number two, you gotta be a little delusional. Tip number three, but you gotta speak in the present moment to get the subconscious to create. Tip number four, to make your subconscious successful for manifesting or program your subconscious for success. Tip number four, I think it's a very important tip right here, is you have to visualize. Visualize, visualize. Man, I can't tell you how important visualization is. You know, for me, it's, one of the, was, it's the most important step because, you know, when, when I use this, if you guys know my program and everything, I won the lottery numerous times doing this. And it was visualization or visualizing was the key. Everything I want, I visualize it. Visualization is a skill. It's a muscle. You can learn it. All you have to do 
is see pictures or if you can see pictures maybe you can feel if you can't feel you can write in present but you see the image it will come in the first or third person when you see that image then you see yourself doing the very thing in the end when it happens in the end it's happening in reality so visualization is the language of the subconscious or unconscious mind you see the thing you gotta understand guys is this we make up our world primarily of our thoughts our thoughts impress a field an invisible field that we can't see in this invisible field we create what we call reality that's how we are in, able to interact and see our goals got, got that does that make sense all right tip number five to program your subconscious for success you have to start to challenge your thoughts a lot of our thoughts are negative a lot of our thoughts are in the past and a lot of our thoughts aren't accurate and logical in other words if your mind is telling you you can't do it you have to challenge it and show what you can how do I challenge my thoughts by proving to your mind that whatever you desire or whatever you want is indeed possible how do I do that mark well whatever you want someone has already achieved it you know that right there's nothing new under the Sun so all you have to do is go to proof on the internet okay I would like to own a house I like to be an entrepreneur I like to start my own business plenty of people have done that search individuals who have started their own business with less than a thousand dollars all of that is out there all you have to do is show your mind that it's possible once you show that to the conscious mind then it can allow the information to get to the subconscious for the subconscious to change in other words to make to make that even simpler for you you have to start to believe that whatever you want or desire is indeed possible okay now along with that I'll give you the bonus tip whenever you're doing that then comes the next point is focus that's the repetition so when someone says how do I focus on this stuff man all it means is you have to repeat this so all those five steps you have to basically every day or every night you want to repeat it think about it and I'll give you even another more bonus tip when is the best time to impress my subconscious right before you go to bed and right when you get up in the morning because you're in a state of a meditative state called theta that's where the subconscious is more open for information but you can do this all the time the key is this guys you have to be consistent persistent repeat the brain is a very miraculous and marvelous machine it's primitive right now we're just evolving because our brains can't per can perceive other realities other dimensions so we're quite limited so the big tip is to realize that you have to impress the brain by repetition and when you're going to impress the brain by repetition it's all about using what the imagination the thing about the brain is there are cells in the brains they call neurons and they're always looking to form connections and if you want to get your brain into a state of new connections you have to keep repeating it sends a signal to these neurons to keep firing neurons fire they wire together they create new neural pathways a new neural pathway is basically a new belief system a new belief system is guess what call it a paradigm a new paradigm is what your reality your beliefs so you can see how intricate intricate and how detailed this stuff is but if you follow those five tips you will manifest success in your life now let me put some more points here about this unconscious mind the thing is this guys show how powerful this is once you're able to do this you are virtually guaranteed success because the thing about the subconscious is once it grabs guess what once it grabs what once it grabs your beliefs it's stuck it's a program now it's an operating system it's a habit it's gonna make you automatically do things to become successful just like you automatically do things to fail right you ever mess yourself up and say god why well, can't do this that's your subconscious your subconscious is programmed for that so that means you're, you virtually can't mess your own self up even if your own mind is still limited in the ego mind your subconscious will take over and make you success this is why you see some people out there you see they always 
successful, no matter what they do. They may have a shitty personality, bad person, anything they have in their life, but they're always successful. That's because they're operating on a subconscious. They're operating on a habit. They're not operating on the logic anymore. See how that works? So if you start to implement that and follow this, then your subconscious will change. And remember, guys, right? Remember, your subconscious controls your reality. The five steps I quickly re recap. I mean, I'll save this video again and I'll see if I upload it to uh, YouTube or something so you can see. But the tip is five steps to really program your subconscious. Someone asked me to repeat that. Step number one, make it normal. See things as normal, as believable. Step no, be a little, Step two, be a little delusional. You have to be able to see your world in the big picture because your subconscious is illogical. It can't see things as normal. Everything to it is normal. Step number three is present moment. You got to speak in the present because it does understand time in the future. In the present, is happening now. Tip number four is visualize. You got to see the images. You got to see all the things you want. Tip number five, question your beliefs, your, your limiting beliefs, what your conscious mind is saying to you. Question it. Prove it to it. Look for results. Look for people who've done what you've done. Get that new program in there. Build beliefs. Those are the five steps or the tips that you can use right now that will program your subconscious for success. How long does it take? Well, it could, anywhere it could take in 90 days. It's up to you. How long, how much determination you put into it, how much repetition, how much discipline, and you'll get the result. This is guaranteed to work. Why is it guaranteed to work? Because let me tell you why it's guaranteed to work. Because you are, I am, all of us, we are programs of subconscious. Everything we do is a subconscious program. We're not thinking. We're operating on automated programs, people. Point blank. You get up in the morning and you think you're, you're not thinking. You're on a program. The program runs so efficiently and so effortlessly that you don't even realize you're on a program. See how it works? You can do this for anything. You can do the program to win the lottery, to the casinos, all that stuff. Because there's nothing that's impossible. If you can dream it, you can achieve it. If you can see it, you can hold it in your hands. Physical reality is the same as mental reality, just a different fragment of existence or experience. Point blank. We know this through neuroscience. We understand that the brain filters information through frequencies and waves. And we are all that. So start practicing that, guys, and you will have great results. All right? See you again.